Welcome to Evangelical End Time Machine. I'm Josie, one of the warriors of the last days. I welcome you in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ. This is my personal testimony on what I have learned on the fallen angels from the messages of the Lord. I would like to share with you something I experienced in 2013 when I was still new to this ministry. One day I was at a Walmart grocery store and walking towards a certain area where my favorite yogurt was located. I noticed a tall man walking in front of me, headed in the same direction. He kept turning around to look at me, and I thought, why is he doing this? And again he turned around to look at me, and then I saw his face. He had it like a smug smirk on his face, and I knew something was wrong. I stopped walking, and the Lord brought into my thoughts the memory and remembrance of a message given to Prophet Benjamin Kosainson titled, Curse broken by God's power. This is about a woman who was speaking with a man in a coffee shop. He was a fallen angel, a chameleon in disguise, and he put a curse of death on her. I called on the name and the blood of Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ, and right away, this tall, human-looking man kind of bent over and walked away very quickly. I thank the Lord that he helped me and protected me from this. In James chapter 4, verse 7, it says, Submit yourselves, therefore, to God. Resist the devil, and he will flee from you. I knew in my spirit this was a fallen angel, a chameleon in disguise. I have learned to have faith and trust in the Lord. Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ. He is faithful and true and will never leave us. After this experience at Walmart, I had been a little fearful and I didn't want to be. I began reading every message on the website on the fallen angels and on spiritual warfare and spiritual warfare prayers. I surrendered myself completely to the Lord and I also went through my house and threw away and destroyed all worldly useless things, such as statutes, books, dolls, pictures, etc. And I prayed earnestly to the Lord and gave him all my fears and said I wanted to be a true warrior of God with a pure heart. He heard my prayers and delivered me from all my fears. Amen. Read Psalm 121, verse 8. The Lord will guard your going out and your coming in from this time forth and forever. And Deuteronomy 31, verse 6. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them, for the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. If we abide in Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ, then we don't fear the fallen angels. They should fear us because Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ, is almighty and he is in us. Greater is he who is in us than he who is in the world. I have learned from this experience to be alert and on guard against Satan at all times, especially now in the last days. The recent attack against this ministry with false videos was sudden and shocking. When I first saw the video, I wondered for a moment, how can this be? But I knew in my heart this video was 100% false, a lie of Satan and his chameleons. And I prayed in faith to the Lord, Yeshua HaMashiach, for Prophet Benjamin and the team. And I felt peace in my heart and knew that Prophet Benjamin is the true and pure prophet of God and one of the two witnesses. Read 1 John 
chapter 4, verse 1. Do not believe every spirit, but you must continually try the spirits to see if they are from God. This ministry belongs 100% to Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ. He is the head, the captain, and him I serve and honor. God has sent over 3,000 messages that always come in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ. If they are of God, you will know and recognize them by their fruits. The Lord has warned us, the fallen angels are on the earth among the people, bent on destroying the work of God. As a warrior of God, be alert and prepared and put on the full armor of God and ask for his blood covering and protection at all times. Be steadfast and stand in the power and strength of Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ. Thank you for listening. God bless you. Ruaha Yeshu Shalom.